Hi friends, welcome to this storytelling session through which you can learn English speaking skills and join me in empowerment of women. This is a true story of a friend of mine. The title of the story is Reshma's New Dawn. Once there was a woman named Reshma who lived with her young son in a small town. Like many women, she had dreams of a happy life. But life took a different turn. Her husband, who she once trusted, began to neglect her and their child, getting involved in other relationships. Despite her efforts to mend the relationship through love, conversation, and even legal help, nothing seemed to change. Acceptance and self-reflection. One day, Reshma realized that she could not change someone else's behavior, but she could control her own response to it. She decided to stop blaming herself and accepted that the situation was beyond her control. This acceptance gave her a sense of clarity and strength. What did she do in the step 2? Building inner strength. Reshma knew that she had to become stronger for herself and her child. She started reading books and listening to stories of women who faced adversity and came out stronger. She found solace in these stories, realizing that she too could shape her own destiny. She made a habit of journaling every morning, noting down three things she was grateful for which helped her focus on the positive aspects of life. Now let's see the step 3. Financial Independence She decided that financial independence was a key to securing her future and that of her child. Reshma joined a course that taught her a new skill and slowly she started taking up freelance work online. This new source of income made her feel empowered and less dependent on her husband. In the step 4, it's building a support system. Reshma reached out to a few trusted friends and family members. She found emotional support in their company and realized that she wasn't alone in her struggle. With their encouragement, she found the courage to take bolder steps towards a better future. She also joined local women's groups and met others who had faced similar challenges, creating a new circle of strength around her. Step 5. Setting Boundaries and Prioritizing Her Child Reshma began to focus on her child's well-being and development. She made sure to give her son the love and attention he deserved creating a nurturing environment at home. At the same time, she set clear boundaries with her husband, demanding respect and clarity about his role in their lives. This gave her a sense of control and self-respect. Step 6. Embracing new opportunities As time passed, Reshma's efforts started bearing fruit. She landed a steady job, and her freelance work flourished. The newfound confidence and financial stability allowed her to make decisions without fear. She began to see that life offered her new opportunities even if it meant creating a new path for herself. Step 7. Inspiring Others Reshma's story of resilience became an inspiration to many women in her time. She started a small group for women facing similar struggles where they would meet weekly to share their stories, discuss new skills and support each other. Reshma had transformed from a woman who felt trapped by her circumstances to one who created her own freedom. Now let's see what message this story has for all of us. It's the message of empowerment. Reshma's story is a reminder that while we can't always change the people around us, we can change ourselves, our outlook and our actions. It's okay to feel hurt, but it's important not 
to stay in that place for too long by focusing on what she could control finding her inner strength and taking small practical steps reshma found a way forward that's all for today guys stay tuned for